on the Listener app and on your radio. This is Triple M's Rush Hour, special Friday edition with JB and Bill. Oh, all right. So you know the audio we play when we win a gold at uh, the Olympics? Oh, yeah. Oh, no. That's Bandow Ballet. That's where that song uh, originated, Rock. of course. Oh. A famous band from uh, the UK in the uh, late 80s, early 90s, mainly 80s. <laughs> now, excuse me. I, it, I'm only going to be able to tell this story if you'll excuse the names that are are about to be dropped. Oh, all right. Because you're name dropping. Yeah, yeah. that's exactly right. right. So 1989, I'm playing Lancashire League cricket up the top. Right. Uh, the Australian team's there playing in that famous Ashes series when we beat England after we were the, meant to be the worst, worst team, team ever to leave to the shores. land on the shores. Yep. And what people don't realise is a 39 year old Dennis Keith Lilly <laughs> was playing county cricket for North Ants. He wasn't. Play, had a season for North Ants at, at 39. Uh, anyway, so I'm up there. And I suddenly, and, and you can imagine, I'm stuck in a tiny little joint in Nelson up in the Lancashire. But how far Funny away? Yeah. Oh, that's a good hour and a half yeah. From, yeah. from North Ants. Anyway, suddenly I get a knock on the door. Mm-hmm. And I open up the door and there's a, a very well-dressed postal you know, courier looking person yeah. with, with a very snazzy envelope. Ooh. And um, I, I thought, thank you. I had no idea how you even knew I was there. I open it up and it says, you are invited to Dennis Lilly's surprise 40th birthday. Nice. Now, the reason, of course, is you know that I know him very Family well is friends, because yeah. his dad and I, uh, he and my dad are close to best mates. And yeah. So I've known him my whole life. Anyway, so I'm like, all right, that's fantastic. So I'm thinking surprise 40th. Yeah. Anyway, about 25 minutes later, the phone rings and it is the great man going, oh. you're coming to my party? Oh. <laughs> I said, I've surprise. just received this thing. It said surprise birthday party. He goes, no, nah, the surprise is that I've got to 40 oh. because he lived nice and hard, yes, he did. of course. But he said, no, nah, it's not a surprise. It's at Lammy's joint. Of course, Alan Lamb played for North Ants. Oh. I think with mean Lammy's down in Geelong. The night. Same, same name, but <laughs> yeah. different. Yeah. Same, same, but different. <laughs> anyway, so I'm like, yeah, bloody oath I'll be there. Yeah. Anyway, so I get it gets to the day. I get my ass down to North Ants. And I go to this party, and it's a it's a who's who. Ooh. And I'm the only other person I knew there beside the great man was yeah. Justin Langer, who was playing in the Surrey Championship somewhere. So the two of us are there. They were, otherwise, we don't know anyone. Yeah. Anyway, as you do when I was about twenty two and JL was about eighteen, we had our we had a good night. Of course, we had oh, a few frosts. Come from a long way away. Yeah, camp the night there somewhere. That's it. So when when the yeah. end of the night came, yes. there weren't many of us left. Oh, good. But good I on. was one. Aussies left. Langer was another one. Yeah. Alan Lamb, because it's his house, so he had no option to go anywhere. <laughs> Dennis Lilly and this other bloke. Ooh. Anyway, so as you know, with idiot Australians, when it gets to three in the morning, whatever it was, and we'd had a, a long go at it, <laughs> the wrestling started. Oh, no. <laughs> and Bill, why do we do that? I don't know. Yeah. And of course, you got DK. Who that stage is still playing as a big bastard. Forty. So he's and and he, he's got Lammy Ooh. in a headlock. L- Legger. Yep. So and and there they landed on top of JL. He's an angry little bastard. Oh, he's Taekwondo. So, so, so he's starting to throw on from underneath. And what are you doing? I'm standing there minding my own business, oh. going, "How juvenile is this? <laughs> How would you bloody end up, you know, wrestling?" Anyway, suddenly this other bloke oh. who's standing there. He yeah. grabs me by the throat. Oh, no. And he's got me in a headlock and he's starting to throw me to the ground. I'm thinking, I'm not copping this. Hey, don't know who you are. <laughs> don't know who he is. Yeah. And I'm not copping it. No. So I somehow grab hold of him and I land on top of him. This is in Alan Lamb's lounge room. <laughs> so I, I've landed on top of this bloke. Yep. And then somehow the three of them have all landed on top of me. Oh, no. So she's oh, a geez. pile on. <laughs> and this bloke's got this real high pitched little pommy voice. He starts screaming that we, he can't breathe and we've got to get up. <laughs> anyway, I'm not giving a stuff about him. I'm trying to get yeah. Langer with a couple of kidney yeah. jobs because well, he couldn't no. tell me you know, yeah, whether it was, it was yeah. me or not. So I'm trying to belt him. Anyway, this bloke's voice is getting louder oh. and louder. Oh, no. I'm thinking, actually, we probably need to get off this get off it, yeah. Five blokes on top of him. Anyway, we get up and he's he'd gone a little pink. <laughs> Sucked in your bomb. Gone a little pink. Anyway, he's sitting down and quietly sort of gathering himself. Yeah. And I said to uh, the champ, I said, who is that bloke? Who is this bloke? This bloke who's just bloody ended up on the on the bottom of a pile on. Oh, he goes, that, didn't you meet him before? I said, no, I don't, I don't know what he is. He, me he goes, his name's John Keeble. He's the drummer from Spandau Ballet. No, the drummer. <laughs> the drummer. And he got you in a headlock. This is him. 
tiny little bastard. And he got you in a headlock. He, well, he got me in a headlock, so I ended up having to spin him. And then they all landed on me. And poor old Keeps, he ended up at the bottom. <laughs> and nearly died. And his voice got very high, Bill. Well, the sound anyway, of that, he so should have. every time we play gold. Gold. You're, that I think my of, of this. <laughs> every time oh. we play that, I think that he was on top. Uh, sorry, on the bottom of a sandwich that had... Three unbelievably good cricketers. And, uh, and a drummer. And, then, and me. And, <laughs> and the little drummer boy. <laughs> and he was underneath. I thought I'd just listen to bloody Robbo. Name dropping. No, well, oh. I did. I, I, I'd said that at the start because I knew that's what you'd say. Oh, Dennis Lilly and yeah. Alan Lamb and Justin Langs Langer and, and then the drummer. And me and John Keeble. <laughs> that's it. <laughs> You've never heard of John Keeble before, no, have I'd you? I've never heard well, of Spandai Bella. <laughs> what did he call him? Spanday Bella. Spanday Bella. <laughs> That's what they are, Jim. Can you believe it? No. No, I actually can believe it. <laughs> anyway, oh, wherever he is, uh, you'll be listening. Yeah. Good on you, Keeps. <laughs> Good on you, Keeps. It's a rush hour, Triple M. <laughs>